opponent. From Queens, New York, weighing in at 185 pounds, he is the five-star stud and the ECWA champion, being accompanied by Jake Hurts. He is Joey. Give me a break. Who's talking to that guy? Who's talking to you? Well, he just hates everyone, Donovan. I'm hating. I'm hating, huh? Look at me. Look at me. I'm the freaking man. Joey Ace in a bad mood as usual. Salty dog. Yes, he's very salty. He calls himself the five star stud, and it sounds like he had a whole bunch of other nicknames as well. Absolutely. He's got his two championships. Um, heavyweight championship is the one being defended here tonight. No, you've got a great memory. These two have been wrestling each other for a long, long time. They always put on great matches. And uh, there's the bell, ladies and gentlemen, once again. Legendary Action Wrestling Brooklyn Brawl 2019. The Ace Dante Jace along with Donovan. We're here to call all the action. And right now the ECWA Championship is being defended. Joey Ace goes to the outside. While Just Neff, his opponent and challenger, stands strong in the ring. Well, now Joey's ready. Berating the fans earlier. And Joey Ace working on the arm of Just Neff. He's got a very tight grip. Very tight grip. Yes, very tight arm bar applied. And Neff able to reverse it. Now he's working on Joey's arm. A little taste of his own medicine. Just Neff was not happy that the music he provided was not played by the DJ earlier. So he's going to be in a bad mood as well, I would assume. Just said about you. Well, yeah, I mean, he, he's just, I mean, I can't take it personally. I know the guy is angry at the world. But, yeah, insults will get you nowhere, Joey. Mm -hmm. Well, just enough in control at the moment. Some great technical action going on. Well, 
Well, Justin Neff calls himself the strategist. He's always going for the best strategy against his opponent. So perhaps he thought the best way to get that title off of Joey Ace was technical wrestling. Which makes perfect sense. Joey being angry as it is, technical wrestling is something that can frustrate anybody. Absolutely. No. One grip on him as you see right here. Joey can't get out of it. He's just going to get frustrated and more frustrated. He won't be able to come out and get out. And he'll just go out to just, just left hands. You're right, Donovan. Joey Ace almost pinned for a three count right there. That was close. Look at the smirk on just left hands. Well, just Neff very pleased with himself. Meanwhile, Joey is not happy at all. He He's talking to his manager, AJ Pan. This is the first we've seen of him here in Legendary Action Wrestling. He sure made his questions known. Yeah, he, um, what would you call him, an advocate for Joey? He looks more like an agent, don't you? Mm. More like an agent. Yeah, well, maybe trying to get some better business deals. That, that may be why this ECWA championship is being defended in an LAW room. He negotiated it. Either way, Joey Ace has Neff tied up, and now he's going to town on him. Oh, hard chop. That chop hurt me. Guys. Me too. We could hear it from here and feel it from here. Oh, look at him fighting oh away God, on the hands. Oh, stop. Oh. Oh. That even hurt Joey. Well, it hurt his hand. He chopped him so hard. But Neff able to reverse it. Oh, there's a hard chop. Piece of his own medicine. Oh. Chopping away on Joey Ace. So far, this has been a game of anything you can do, I can do better. I can do anything better than this. That's like, <laughs> oh, Joey Ace. Maybe a little back shoot there. But, oh, beautiful drop kick from Joey Ace. And just enough rolling to the outside, but he is right next to Pan. I don't think that was. Oh, look at that! Look at cheap shots to the to the to the uh, guts or the back. I'm not sure what he was targeting there. And, uh, it, and it shows its effectiveness because just enough didn't even stay down after those two kicks. No, very very weak man is AJ Pan, but you can't say that for Jerry Ace. Oh, he's got the, the hair. He's got the man bun. Oh, rams him right into that steel guard ring. Just Neff may have his face rearranged. And what's this, a can of Coke? What is going on here? Oh, bust that can of Coke right on Just Neff's head. As if the steel guard ring wasn't a good thing. Just Neff maybe busted open. He's, he's got a headache for sure. Maybe and Joey, oh, tries to crotch Just Neff. Just Neff able to pull Joey's head right into that steel turnbuckle. Once again, it's his face in the steel. Just Neff gets his face in the steel. Now Joey gets his face in the steel. Right, the steel turnbuckle pole, I should have said. And there, there, there's a turnbuckle right there. Using all parts of the ring as a weapon. Oh, and right now, Just Neff looks wouldn't you be if you just got a can of Coke smashed in your face? Especially if he's a Pepsi fan. Well, perhaps the Pepsi plunge is coming up later on. There's a vertical suplex. Well, his hand is still hurting from that chop. Well, Joey Ace had his arm worked on earlier. I believe it was the uh, left arm. Oh, look at this. He just let that, he broke that turnbuckle pad. And not sure what what strategy he's going for here. Uh, that agent over there just told him. Yeah, maybe he wants uh, maybe he wants to use it as a weapon. Maybe maybe pick that steel. Oh, but just as I say that, just Neff had that idea. Here's a cover, only a two count. Rep says two. I mean. You can't blame the ref for not saying anything there because Joey was the one who brought that ring rope into the ring to be used as a weapon. Once again, and the strategist in control. The championship's on the line, and as you know, championship can't change hands. 
absolutely right. ECW WA Championship on the line and just now. And a lot of pain there. Joey Ace using that pull to wrap his arm around. This is pain in his arm. Oh, drops him down to the outside. Now in soccer roof, we have a turf here, but that's concrete right under this grass turf. Absolutely, Donovan. I mean, they're doing what it takes, pulling out all the stops, trying to win the title. And there's a two count, very close to being three. We, we almost had a new ECWA champion. One second away. Joey Ace working, chopping away on the chest once again. And just Neff drops to a knee. I tell you what, Chevy really doesn't seem to care about the health of his arm. Those chops keep hurting him. But you know what? They have an effect. It's Joey Stone. He's willing to put himself through a lot of pain in order to get the win here tonight. But that right there. Well, just Neff. Yeah. Referee may have not believed it, but uh, either way, Joey Ace in control. Oh, he, is, he, he is ripping at that arm. Wrenching away on it. So sure is. Just Neff may have to submit right here. And even as Joey Ace is uh, putting on this submission, Joey's also giving himself some ice. You're right, Donovan. Very smart by Joey, able to recover. But just Neff fighting out of it. Just to the midsection. Ramming his head right into Joey Ace. And there's a boot. Another chop. A lot of chops in this match. And look at this, just going to town on the salty dog. This is just adrenaline right here. This is just instinct. Doesn't matter how, how hurt his arm is. He's just going for it. Absolutely. Just like that, Joey turns the tables. Oh, and smack him. Joey, Joey Ace, always on his game. And look at this. Head of steam. Oh, and Just Neff hits him right in the face. Kicks him, I should say. Rolls through. Shot to the midsection. Oh, big knee. Joey Ace in a world of trouble. Uh, Just Neff is really feeling it now. Adrenaline's pumping. Fans getting behind Neff. Elbow to the top of Joey's head. There's a second one. Oh, back fist right to the side of Joey's face. Oh, I don't think Joey knows where he is right now. No, he's on Dream Street. This may be just enough opportunity to take that ECWA championship. What's he gonna do here? Oh, big boot. Catches Joey, goes for the cover, two and only two. I was sure they had that. I was sure. It was very, very close, two and seven eighths. And Donovan, just Neff, may be going for the finishing blow here. But Joey Ace with a spinning kick to the midsection. And what is this? Lifts him up. Oh, sit out, spine buster, two, and, and oh, there on. you have Pan interfering, distracting the referee. This is disgusting. You can't ruin his investment, right? No, he's doing whatever it takes. But just Neff still in control. He may have to go for something else here. For some elbow shots. Chops away once again on Just Neff. I mean, he may need his arm amputated after this one. 
Oh, but just Neff goes behind. He's got the full Nelson applied. Picks him up for the Fisherman's Buster. Cover two, only two. Joey kicks out once again. That is amazing, Donovan. What resilience shown by Joey Ace. Tell you what, you can see whatever you want about Joey. Man, oh man, is he a tough, tough guy. Very tough individual. And there's Pan up on the ring apron again. Justin F looking to shut this guy up, but meanwhile, Joey Ace. Oh, he kicks his own man right off the ring apron. Going for that. Oh, but he, did he reverse it? Joey Ace reversed it. Yes, he did. Goes for the cover, and that's it. That's a three count. Joey Ace wins the match. And I don't have a microphone. Well, fans, Joey Ace retains his ECWA championship. Regardless if it is announced or not, he is the winner here. He defeats Just Neff due to interference from AJ Pan. That last reversal by Joey Ace, I didn't even realize what happened until the end. That was amazing. It was absolutely something special, Donovan. What a match. 